Hey everyone, this is Tony Teaches Tech. I'm Tony, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to duplicate posts and pages in WordPress. We're gonna use a plugin to do this. Let's go ahead and get on into the tutorial. I'm here on my WordPress website. I'm, let's go into the admin dashboard, and in here, go to plugins and add new. Now, we're gonna use a plugin called Post Duplicator. And the reason I'm using this plugin is because it's 100% free. There is no upgrades for premium features or anything like that. And it's just it just does what it's supposed to do. So it's a good, honest plugin. So go ahead and install and activate that and you'll see it show up in your list of plugins here. In order to access the settings, this is just a one-time thing, go to um, Tools and then Post Duplicator. In here, I just wanna point out a couple things. The post status, make sure that's draft, okay? If you had same as original in the post that you're copying or the page that you're copying was public, that would also be public or status of published. Uh, we don't want that. We want them always to be copied as a draft. Um, same thing down here, uh, Another uh, other couple settings. If you want to change them, the duplicate title, you can have copy or copy, you can pick that to be whatever you want. So basically if your title, you know, we'll see this in a couple of minutes, a couple seconds, but if your title is called how to uh, make a WordPress website and you copy that post with the plugin, the next post is gonna be how to make a WordPress website copy. And same thing with the slug, which is the URL, that last part of the URL after your domain name, we're just gonna append copy to that as well. If you wanna customize that, you can change that. Okay, so that looks good. If you change something, go ahead and click on save changes. Let's go ahead and duplicate a post and a page. So in our posts section here, I'm gonna pick a public post here, seven critical Django production server settings to configure before going live. So you see this new option here to duplicate post. Really simple, all you have to do is click on duplicate post and we will now have a new post in here, which is essentially what I just talked about, the name of the post with copy appended after it, it is set as a draft. If we click on that and go in to take a look at it, we'll see that the slug has been altered as well with copy being appended to the end. And um, we're good to go, because it's a draft. So you can do whatever you want in here. Same thing works for pages. So let's go to our pages section. Uh, let's copy who is Tony. So same type of thing, duplicate page this time. And we will now end up with another copy of that set to be a draft. Same type of thing in here. If you click on it, we have instead of about, it's about dash copy. Um, that's about it guys. Thank you for watching this video. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below. I'll do my best to help you out. Subscribe for more videos like this about WordPress tips and tricks. And if you do, I'll see you in the next video.